Hi guys, for today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to use uh, account if formula, okay? Count if range plus criteria. So, we will begin in approved, approved as, approved is 5, B approved as noted is 110, C revised and resubmit is 0, D for information 0 e incomplete 0 and the review is 15 so this is inspection report log for electrical okay as you can see these are all electrical so we are going to count how many approved how many approved as noted how many revised and submit for information incomplete and under review so as a document control we are uh, doing the log enable for us to update how many approval we got and how many submission for inspection report we have so using the count if formula from H this is H okay and this is the cells okay so we will begin in the cell H and 15 so H and 15 okay down to 1000 okay so we have to we have to start in in uh, equal sign okay count if H as I told you we have to start in here 15 here is the cells okay colon H 1000 it is the number of cells down to 1000 sheets 1000 cells i'm sorry and then a stands for approved this is the criteria you have to put this column up here and this column up here and then this is the approved a stands for approved so same scenario as here same h15 colon h down to 1000 and b this is the formula the criteria for approved as noted the same thing here c is stands for revise and submit the same thing here h uh, h15 colon down to h1000 cells which is uh, d is stands for for information so e for uh, incomplete and d for uh, and under review uh, e you are for under review sorry so okay okay so i repeat this is using the county formula we'll start for h which is in this cell and then to sheet uh, cells 15 okay cell h to 15 down to 1000 okay so h15 colon h1000 a stands for approved h15 colon h1000 down to h1000 stands for b stands for approved as noted h15 okay colon h1000 down to h1000 you have to put the the column from the up and C for revise and resubmit, D for information, E for incomplete, and under review. Okay, so I will show you how to count it. We, we, using those formula, we have to go to uh, cell 15 here. Okay, so we are going to go to revision 1. Okay, this is the revision 1. So assuming that this is b okay b and b as you can see while i'm changing the 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 status the the in the h okay in the h cell it's changing the color here as well as the approval okay so we're going to change this b to a because the approval is always from b okay if you get approval from b it will gonna be a the next approval okay so if we receive um in, if we receive in revision one an a okay so it's 
as you can see here on the top of the formula okay on the top of the number which is on approved it will gonna be if you hit the enter it's gonna be three so and the next line in the next sheet which is i'm in sheet 16 as you can see i'm in h16 h16 okay so i'm gonna hit the button here and i'm gonna place an approval of a so as you can see on the top if i will hit the enter it will become four so the approved as noted reduced to 111 it means there is approval of approved which additional of two and the uh, b which is approval as noted reduced the number it's become 111 so we will go on again a another a so it will come become five and b become 110 okay so you will see the total here okay it's the same because we are just keep changing the status only okay so i will i will change the status again here it will become six i will change the status here again eight it will become take for counting it manually so if i'm gonna edit here and i have the approval already i submitted this uh the submittal for electrical on September and 20, September 2, 2020. So the status now coming from the consultant, I'm going to edit for revision 1. It's uh, like somehow C. Okay, you have to place the caps lock C as you place the C here, over here. Okay, which is in the yellow color. The same thing because it will not count if you... If you uh, make it in a small letter if you place a caps lock so make it all caps lock the same the same letter okay so if you're gonna hit the enter okay so the as you can see one is change okay one is change because as we are count editing okay and we are in the range of h h uh, cell and the counts begin at H15 down to H1000. So there's another under review here. As you can see, the under review reduced, reduced to 14. And the, sta the total status is remain as 130. So you're going to place the D here. Okay, make sure it is caps lock. The same as for information, the caps lock that we created for criteria. And we will hit the enter. So you can see D came here and the uh, under review reduced to 13. Okay, and the D changed to 1. Okay, so we will make the under review E here. Okay, as you can see, if I change it into revision 1, it changed along here in the cell H. Here, it is cell H, it changed to E. So as you can see, the E red here and the E red here it counts to 1. Okay, this is the purpose of using the formula count if. Okay, so it makes easy for a document control to count. Okay, perfectly. Okay, how many submissions we already submitted in the consultant or the consultant submitted to contractor okay so i hope you guys like my tutorial for uh, today and see you for another tutorial thank you so much bye